Hey everybody, here we are going out of the holler. I wanted to uh, show you um, a few pictures of the roads and the mountains. So we're traveling out of the holler here and uh, look how beautiful everything is. Uh, everything's so green and okay now we're on to the main drag right here and um, heading on down the road. Some of the pictures weren't that good just like right here there's a lot of glare on the picture from the camera and the car windshield uh, but it, they turned out pretty good taking pictures from a tra moving car. Right here we're down here at the little town I grew up in. Uh, it's a little old one horse town. We got a couple stoplights. <laughs> But we're heading on down to the road the drove we traveled to Walmart and it is classified as one of the top ten most dangerous roads in America and really these pictures don't do them much justice because you really can't tell um, you know what we see but you might get a little glimpse of what we travel on I really, James and I wanted to show you the side of the cliffs like right here we're going up on a little mountain road here and um, the roads are really narrow they have the rock face right there on the right hand side and on the left hand side it's just a sheer drop off down to the tracks below, the railroad tracks below but uh, James it was tried to explain to you how the rocks were formed here and stuff. But right here is a new uh, bridge they're trying to put in for us, which is connected to the road that they're trying to build. They've been working on this road probably seven, eight years. And I'd say it would be 10 or 15 more years before they're finished with this section of the road, which is about 15 miles long. It takes big time money to build roads here where we live because of the terrain, the conditions, the mountain conditions but uh, one of these days we'll have a road that's decent a four lane that's decent to drive on right here we're coming up on another little uh, mountain road um, we call these the blind curves because when you go up on this little road right here you really can't see uh, around these curves what's coming at you and the road is extremely extremely narrow and broken out off on the left hand side there and uh, it's very dangerous in the winter time when you have to go to Walmart on this road okay we're back down on a little piece of flat land but we're getting ready to go back up on another little mountain road <clears throat> this one's pretty bad too very narrow roads uh, it's uh, you know you're, you're riding right beside a, a rock wall that crumbles and right here this big thing is called a it's called the hanging rock I expect it to fall Anytime I expect to hear that that rock has fallen and broke the highway off because many times there has been the highway has even broke off the whole two lanes of it and they've had to go in there and build it up and but we're off this little road now we're coming to an area that's got the vocational school on the left hand side there and it's called uh, Three Mile Curve a uh, you probably can't tell that they we're driving on a curve but this curve is three miles long now we're on to the little place uh, another place that's got a very bad rocks on the right hand side uh, every time you come down here there's rocks in the road uh, big boulders they have to clean it up all the time and um, when we go through here I just I just say get us through here as fast as you can because I just expect a, a rock to fall on us and kill us you know there's been people killed with trees falling off here and uh, but we've turned back around we didn't go all the way to Walmart we just we came down the road to take pictures of the prep plant that they're building I don't show you those pictures but right now we're right back at that three mile curve area and uh, you might be able to tell a little bit more how curvy it is. Look how beautiful the sky is and the mountains. We're back up on that mountain road but on the other side and they've tried to put a, a concrete wall here to protect people. Um, as you can see that, if you can see by the pictures, it's um, now we're on the on the blind curve area. You might be able to see how the road is broken off here a little bit and uh, guardrails pushed over where people have wrecked. And um, I'm showing you some pictures of where they're, you know, cutting through to make make a road. And um, 
but <clears throat> here's that new bridge uh, from the other side, a view from the other side, and of course I had to put railroad tracks here because we have them all over the place. But we're heading on back to the little town um, that I grew up in uh, on the last mountain road here. Um, just to give you an idea of uh, the road we travel. You see the little garbage bags on the side of the road. The county makes prisoners clean up, you know. Um, right here's a new bridge that they, right outside the little town I grew up in. Um, I don't know if I ever get to drive on that bridge. Hopefully one day I will if they ever get it finished. And now we're moving <coughs> back, <coughs> excuse me, back down into the little town I grew up in. Just a little old town's got two two streets in it front street and back street <laughs> and then now we're back at the mouth of the holler heading up the holler hope you enjoyed this is melissa reporting from up in the holler bye everybody